This is Handy Particle. Let me show you how to create a flow of shapes within a traffic sign in a few seconds. We'll start by exploring the Handy Particles UI. Next, we'll dive into the mechanics of animating the produced shapes. So, this is our traffic sign, and this is Handy Particles. First of all, I will, because I'm lazy, create a shape from um, a font, and this font is the N arose. So, let's type the letter N, for example, or the letter D, maybe. Yeah, this is the, the arrow that I used in the demo. So now that we have this arrow, I will use this feature from Tricks to turn it immediately into a shape. Now that we have our outlines, I will launch handy particles. You have here the amount of particle that you want to set up. I would choose 12 particles or let's say 14. And then you can select an ellipse, a rectangle, star, polygon, triangle, bar for the rain, for example, and custom shape. So now I will select the flow of the custom shapes that I will create. So let's launch the tool. On the layer, you will see here that you have many options. The first one is to select the reference layer, our deep outlines. Immediately, you can see the particles here. I will increase the size as I input. I will turn off the outline layer. And now I have my setup here and it's already working but we are not interesting in a falling flow. I will turn, or I will rotate my flow, replace it, and now we will have a flow from the right to the left. I don't want this. I will right click and just in transform, select, flip vertically. Now I have the flow that I want. I can have the flow in reverse. I mean, using the vertical speed, I can have this flow in reverse. Let's go ahead and select a color, white for example, and the stroke fill color, let's say a punchy yellow, and maybe the stroke side would be five points. Okay, I can, of course, use the scale to rescale my little setup. Otherwise, I will use here the mate option and select my circle, which is a mate. And now I have my arrows and my flow. And that's it. This is how handy particles work.